بسم الله الحمد لله لا إله إلا هو ولا حول ولا قوة إلا به والصلاة والسلام على نبيه ورسوله المصطفى الأمين وعلى آله وصحبه أجمعين أما بعد This is our walkthrough for resource number 19 in our Ajur Rumiya workbooks. We're on page number 124. And these are the questions that go along with lesson number 19. As'ilatu muraja'a. These are review questions. Min ad-dars tasi'a ashar. From the 19th lesson. So at this point, you've studied lesson number 19. You've reviewed it. And you've attempted to complete this activity on your own. And you've even checked your answers in the answer key. And now, we'll go over the questions and answers together. Seeking the aid and assistance of Allah, tabarak wa ta'ala. As-su'alu al-awwalu. The first question. Qala al-imam ibn Ajurrum rahimahullah. The imam ibn Ajurrum, may Allah have mercy on him, stated, وَأَمَّا حَذْفُ النُّونِ فَيَكُونُ عَلَامَةً لِلنَّصْبِ فِي مَاذَا When is the deletion of a noon a sign of a word being mansub? A. الأسماء الخمسة B. الفعل المضارع الذي لم يتصل بآخره شيء C. ثلاثة مواضع Or D. الأفعال الخمسة التي رفعها بثبات النون And this opening question is, as usual, a very direct and easy one. The actual text of the Ajur primer is وَأَمَّا حَذْفُ النُّونِ فَيَكُونُ عَلَامَةً لِلنَّصْبِ فِي الْأَفْعَالِ الْخَمْسَةِ الَّتِي رَفْعُهَا so then, answer choice D is the actual statement of the author. السؤال الثاني, the second question. اختر ما ليس من الأمثلة الخمسة. Pick one of the following items which is not from the five examples, the five verb scales that are significant to us on this topic. A. Yajlisuna B. Rajulani C. Yashrabani Or D. Tektubina So quite obviously, we have three verbs here, and we have a dual plural noun, which cannot be min al amthidatil khamsa. Where's the dual plural noun? It is answer choice B. Rajulani As for answer choice A, Yajlisuna, then that is one of Al Afal El Khamsa. Yafalani Tafalani Yafaluna Tafaluna Tafalina. There's Yajlisuna. And Yashrabani, an answer choice C is one of them. And Tektubina is another one of those five Amthila. So B is the correct answer choice. It is not one of those five verbs. It's not even a verb. السؤال الثالث The third question مثال ما فيه فعل منصوب علامة نصبه حذف النون An example of a word that is a mansub verb showing the sign of being mansub the sign is a deleted noon A وإن كان ذو عسرة فنظرة إلى ميسرة from Surah Al-Baqarah. B. وَأَنْتَ صَدَّقُوا خَيْرٌ لَكُمْ إِنْ كُنْتُمْ تَعْلَمُونَ C. وَاتَّقُوا يَوْمًا تُرْجَعُونَ فِيهِ إِلَى اللَّهِ Or D. ثُمَّ تُوَفَّى كُلُّ نَفْسٍ مَا كَسَبَتْ وَهُمْ لَا يُظْلَمُونَ So we're looking for a فعل منصوب علامة نصبه حذف Anun. So answer choice A doesn't even have a fi'l. It doesn't even have any verbs. So we can eliminate that one easily. As for answer choices C and D, then we don't have 
any fi'l mudari' mansub. We have wattaqu, fi'lu amr, a command. Turja'una, we have a fi'l mudari'un. But because it has a noon on it, we know it is marfu'a. And those are the only possibilities there. So C cannot be the correct answer choice. And then we have D. ثُمَّ تُوَفَّ كُلُّ نَفْسٍ مَا كَسَبَتْ وَهُمْ لَا يُظْلَمُونَ We have the word يُظْلَمُونَ, a verb, but it has a noon as well. And therefore it must be مَرْفُوَ The only possible answer choice we have is found in B. And it's not تَعْلَمُونَ why not? Because ta'lamun has a noon. That's marfu'a. Where is the fi'l mansub in the verse? It is tasaddaqu. Originally, tasaddaquna. Wa an tasaddaqu khayrun lakum. And so, tasaddaqu is fi'lun mansubun bi an because of the an device that comes before it. And it is mansub. Mansubun alamatu nasbihi hadfun noon. That's what we're looking for. So B is the correct answer choice. As-su'alu rabi'u The fourth question. A'rib yukhrija min qawlihi ta'ala qalu in hadani la sahirani yuridani an yukhrijakum min ardikum bisihrihima. The 63rd verse of Surah Taha. We're looking for the i'rab of the word yukhrijakum, but take off the kum. Yukhrija. Our answer choices were A. Ismun mansubun alamatu nasbihi al alif. B. Fi'lun mansubun alamatu nasbihi al kafu wal mimu. C. فعل منصوب علامة نصبه حذف النون or D فعل مرفوع علامة رفعه ثبات النون Okay, so let's get rid of A اسم منصوب This is clearly a فعل This is a verb And then D فعل مرفوع it can't be marfu because it's from al amthilatul khamsa. It would have a noon like yuridani, yukhrijani kum, but rather it's yukhrijakum. The noon has been removed here. So its sign of being marfu could not be thabatun noon. It is not marfu, it does not have a noon. So D is an incorrect answer choice. We're left with answer choices B or C. Both of them agree it's a fi'l mansub. One of them strangely says that the sign of it being mansub is a calf and a meme, something we have never heard of as a sign of a word being mansub. But answer choice C has alamatu nasbihi hadfun noon. That sounds perfect, and that is the correct i'rab of yukhrija. It is a fi'lun mudari'un min al-amthilati al-khamsa. Mansubun bi'an alamatu nasbihi hadfu noon Barakallahu fikum. As-su'alu al-khamisu wal-akhir. The fifth and final question. A'rib yanzurun. فِي قَوْلِهِ تَعَالَى أَفَلَا يَنْظُرُونَ إِلَى الْإِبِلِ كَيْفَ خُلِقَتْ What is the i'rab of the word يَنْظُرُونَ in the verse? Notice يَنْظُرُونَ is from الْأَمْثِلَةُ الْخَمْسَ يَفْعَلُونَ It's on that scale. And it has the noon, so then we know it's marfu'a. We know this going into our search for the correct answer. A. فعل مضارع منصوب علامة نصبه الفتحة الظاهرة على آخره ب فعل مضارع منصوب علامة نصبه ثبات النون س اسم منصوب علامة نصبه الفتحة الظاهرة على آخره أو د فعل مضارع مرفوع 
علامة رفعه ثبات النون نيابة عن الضمة. And that must be our correct answer. Answer choice D is correct. As for answer choices A and B, then they both say that the verb is mansub, and we see the noon on it, so it can't be mansub. The sign of that word being mansub would be hadfun noon. And as for answer choice C, that classifies the word as an ism, and that is absolutely incorrect. The correct answer choice is D. Barakallahu fikum. I hope you've been doing really well. Time to review these lessons and get ready for lesson number 20, insha'Allah. May Allah Ta'ala give you success and forgive your sins. Wa salli Allahumma wa sallim wa barik ala nabiyyina Muhammadin wa ala alihi wa sahbihi ajma'in.